It was a record breaking encounter the last time these two sides met. The most goals scored in a single lonely game by any side as Bonnie Rig Rose put 13 past Vale of Leithen. Robbie Horn, who celebrated his three year anniversary back in charge of the Rose earlier this week, makes seven changes for the home side tonight. In goals, number one, Mark Greer, 19, Scott Gray, four, Kerr Young, 20, Bob Wilson, five, Hoskins. 21 Bradley Barrett, it's 10 Curry, 7 Turner and 11 Ross Gray. Up front, 14 George Hunter and 18 Nathan Evans. For the visitors this evening, we have 1 Kyle Wilson, 2 Reese Anderson, 3 Aidan McFarlane, 4 Ben Brady, 5 Andy Mackay, 6 Matty O'Crawler, 7 Michael Robertson, 8 Mikey Joyce, 9 Mark Dea, 10 Ben Viola and number 11 Louis Graham. First time pass there to Nathan Evans. It's low again and George Hunter is an unbelievable save. What a save that is from Kyle Wilson. And it gets a round of applause even from the Rose faithful here. They recognise what a fantastic save that was from the Vale keeper. But still alive, Scott Gray sends that and Ross Gray can turn it off the line again by Vale. Rose have had so many chances with the back of the net but they've been denied by a stern defence here from Vale of Leithen. They are from Lee Curry. It means that Ross Gray has got a little bit of space to drive into. He was marshalled there by Graham. But Barrett's on the wing now. Gray, and he sends that through to Barrett, which is squared, and it's tapped in by Nathan Evans. The Rose breakthrough hasn't been the most accomplished performance so far from the Rose, but they get their goal on 22 minutes. That's Bonnie Rose Athletic 1. Veil of Leithen, nil. Lee Curry delivers now. And George Hunter was there, but it's headed away defiantly by the Veil defence. Lee Curry again now. Switches it out. And here's Kerr Young. And he loves a spectacular goal, but that one was never good enough at the back of the day. Diaz over this one, but it's well over from the striker. Barrett coming inside now, still using those dancing feet and Ross Gray almost doing the same, confusing himself, means he can't get. Good turn there from Lee Curry, he's going to trip, trip that over to Dean Hoskins, will he get onto it? He does, and he sends it to the back post, there's plenty of space there, great block on the line, George Hunter follow-ups and sends it over the bar, that surely had to be a goal for the Rose, George Hunter looking for number nine of the season, it's not to come yet. Lee Curry, usually so reliable from the spot for Bonnie Rig Rose, has missed his last two, will he break that duct now? And he chips it, and it's a hand tip from Wilson, but it does just trickle into the back of the net. And it's almost a reluctant round of applause here from the Rose fans beneath us, but it does make it. Boy Rig Rose Athletic 2, Bailey Lee the nil. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> On for a couple of them, there are Cole Knight and Keenan Halls. On to this, kind of use his pace, but Brady gets his ahead of him, gets his foot in. And the ref brings this game to a close. Not as convincing as the meeting a month ago. Not as many goals. But the Rose keep on picking up points. The league leaders pick up another three here this evening.